Hi guys, good morning. So this is Arlene from the Philippines. How are you doing today? I hope everyone is safe and I hope you have a good morning. So I'm here in Rosario, Batangas because I'm gonna feature a 3.1 hectare property here in Rosario, Batangas. And as you can see, uh, this property is directly along the Barangay Road which makes this property very accessible. Aside from the fact that it's it has like uh, two times or two uh, routes going to Rosario Town proper. So one route is uh, seven kilometers away from Rosario Town proper. The other one is five kilometers away. And of course, um, as you know, if you are familiar with the areas, Rosario Batangas is a first class municipality of Batangas province. And we are hoping in the next two to three years, it will become a city. Only it's missing some of its population to be categorized as a city okay so but before i forget i want to thank all my subscribers for continuously supporting my channel thank you so much guys it really means a lot and for those who haven't subscribed to my videos please do subscribe and don't forget to hit the like button so thank you so much guys so let's check this property okay so guys so this is the barangay road so this is the seven kilometers i'm telling you about so from this point up to rosario town proper it will be seven kilometers away and if you're gonna go on this side okay it will be five kilometers away so because there are two access points in order to reach this property okay so over here it's a little bit okay so over here is uh, the property is highly uh, is elevated because as you can see over here so we have here a, a small creek okay so I'm gonna go down so you can see it so this is the creek so it's cemented so you are safe okay so this is the creek okay over there so there's not so much water here and over here as well not so much water okay so the property starts right here after the creek so uh the boundary should be here okay where you can see some tall coconut trees and uh, lansonis trees okay lansonis trees usually are on the side because they need water and going up to that side so we're gonna go on that side okay so we will measure as i gonna walk we're gonna measure the frontage of this property okay so if you are not familiar with rosario batangas rosario batangas as i said is a first class municipality of batangas province it has 48 barangays and this property is very close to rosario town proper so seven kilometers away if you go on this route and the other one is five kilometers away so it's really very close so rosario batangas has a lot of has a lot of things to offer so it has several banks churches private schools you know and supermarkets and groceries so i'm still here So the frontage is quite long. So let me check. So the property is on my right side, okay? So but first I want to go into measuring the frontage. And that way you will see it. So there's my little sister. She's gathering some vines. I think uh, Ampalaya leaves. Okay, so we are very close. So the property ends right here where you can see the concrete post, okay? So from here, everything there, and there, and there, 
up to that point where I was walking before. So approximately the frontage is around 300, uh, 250, 250 to 300 meters. Okay, so I'm going to go inside because I want to check what's more actually from what I can see here. So as I can see here, there's several coconut trees and a few of these very nice acacia trees which I really like and I was informed as well that there are like over 200 lansones trees which can yield a harvest of around minimum 50,000 pesos during its good year okay so the very good thing about this property is that it has not so many uh, trees you know fruit bearing trees in that way you can still decide what kind of fruit bearing trees you want to plant here it's nice i can also hear some birds and that one is a big mango tree that's also good So they made already a pass here and that way you can go okay so aside from uh, several or I think it's more than several right coconut trees and acacia trees there are also some of these citrus okay yeah like that one although it needs a little bit maintenance because it needs clearing in order to bear fruits really like this one too so guys if you ask me by by the, uh, the coconut trees you will have an income uh, every 45 days okay and that way coconut trees are very stable you know and over here on this side of course you will have the lansones trees because lansones trees they are usually growing on river banks or creek side okay so this is actually very good because on on this on all sides you will have the lansones trees so in that way uh you can plant a lot of fruit bearing trees if you like so these are all these are all lansones trees okay they are mature ones and actually they are pretty good and of course this property is bordered by a creek as well so if you will see it so this property is quite elevated so this is a big lansones trees tree sorry and all lansones trees over there okay and there you go that is the creek so which means that this property is elevated I'm not sure if i can go because i'm not wearing my proper shoes for this just want to have a little bit look okay so that is the creek guys so of course if you're gonna buy this property then you will have access to a lot of bamboo trees bamboo trees are good if you want to build your own bahay kubo so you just need the metal sheet and some nails and then you can have your bahay kubo so all these things all these trees they are all uh lansones trees i think if i'm not mistaken i'm not so sure i think it's more than 200 trees because uh i was informed it's all on the side so now i'm gonna go up so i'm gonna go up so guys the salient point of of this 3.1 hectare property rosario batangas are the following so first it is 
along the Barangay Road, which means it is very accessible. Number two, it has two access points. You know, the you can go the longer route, which is seven kilometers, and you can go the other one, five kilometers away from Rosario Town proper. And number three, um, as soon as Rosario Batangas become becomes a city this property for sure will double its market value so this is a very good time to to invest in this property and number four it has a lot of root bearing trees like hundreds of coconut trees hundreds of lanzones trees and several citrus trees which is already means that you already have a source of income if you're gonna buy this property okay so when it comes to the price of this property it is priced at 800 pesos per square meter or 25 million pesos negotiable okay so here um i have to explain it to you guys that the price uh posted or uh, the price available for this property is subject to change without prior notice because um most of the times the moment i made the video the price is like this but after like one one week two weeks or three weeks or even you know the the day the owner will say arlene i changed the price something like that so of course i cannot do anything about it okay so uh, because i'm just following so here i will check a little bit on this side so here um I don't know what happened but most probably the tree was cut and most probably it was destroyed by the typhoon several months ago so they had to make use of it so they had to cut it and over here over here you have the citrus and I must say that the coconut trees are really nice they are really uh, having a lot of fruits so I'm sorry guys but I'm I was really mistaken because um this property has more than 200 lanzones trees because I'm here now and I can see everything here there's really a lot of lanzones trees and there's a nice acacia tree over here and there's a mango tree so I'm gonna go here this one is a big pomelo tree So guys, all this as well, these are all, these are all Lansonis trees. So it's really nice. All Lansonis trees. So this means that you really have a very good source of income. Why? Maybe you will say why Ireland is saying that Lansonis is a good source of income guys because if you're gonna buy in the supermarket or in the food stall or food stand a kilo of Lansonis will cost from 180 pesos to 250 pesos per kilo okay but if you don't want to sell it in retail you can also have somebody get it for you on a lump sum basis and then still you will have uh you will still get the very good price for it okay so this property this 3.1 hectare property in rosario batangas is an agricultural land okay don't get me wrong because some people will ask what is the classification so guys this is agricultural land And of course, agricultural land will of course will take some additional one or two months for processing because we have to secure dark clearance for it. Okay. So I'm really amazed at this property because all around the property, guys, it's all planted with Lansonis trees. Look at that. So I, I am totally, or I can be totally wrong. So it can be over 300 Lansonis trees. That's perfect. It's really nice. All around. 
So the shape of this property is like a, a big L. But it's all, the frontage is really along the Barangay Road. So which means it is perfect. So all this guys, all of that, those are all Lansones trees up to that point. So imagine how much, for me, it's really a good source of income. So, and can I tell you a little bit something? Um, it's not part of the property I'm selling, but I have a very good friend. She bought a 7,000 square meter property in Lipa City and it was, it is planted with around 200 Lansones trees, but she bought it last year and during the time it was not so easy to transport goods and services, right? Uh, but she was able to, to sell uh, a few boxes of Lansones fruits in her condo and she was able to get really a good amount of money plus uh, yeah she said uh, she didn't expect that because basically she said it's it's really yeah she couldn't believe that she will get money directly after buying the property right so she was very happy and now I have uh, the property titled into her name so she was super duper happy about it so of course but enough of that so guys this is 3.1 hectare property located in rosario batangas for 25 million pesos so if you are interested in this property please email me at oli.arlin at gmail.com or you can visit my facebook page at arlin Lebandowski, or you can send sms whatsapp or bible message at 0917-6214090 thank you so much guys for watching i'm catching my breath it's very hot here so just a quick update i'm learning how to fly a drone so sooner i will have some aerial shots of the property so thank you so much guys stay safe bye